Hey guys, EBP Man here. Now in today's video, we're going to take a look at charging solutions for all of your electronics that you may have in your home. Uh, and these are really, really interesting looking chargers. This is from Shargi. This is the Storm 2. And we're also going to be looking at a 100 watt uh, charger. That's, again, going to charge your laptop, your iPad, your Samsung tablet, your Samsung phone. Doesn't really matter. As long as you have a USB-C port, you're going to be able to charge with these guys. And they're going to charge super duper fast. So the first thing that you'll notice about the Storm 2 is that the Storm 2 is kind of really unique when it comes to the overall aesthetics, right? We're talking about like a cyberpunk transparent case that has 25,600 milliamp hours. Now, large battery, but you're going to be able to charge it really fast. You're talking about 1.5 hours to recharge. And it does have a lot of ports that we're going to see two USB, one USB-A, and one DC out. Now it does have a real cool display that you can see here. And this display, we'll flip it over like this, uh, basically is gonna give you a lot of information. It's gonna give you information about your voltage, your current, and the power that's being used. And it also has some functionality where you can make some slight adjustments. Now, if you're wondering, you know, what am I gonna be able to do with a charger like this? How much battery power will it supply to my devices? So if you're thinking about an iPhone, charging at 20 watts, you're gonna be able to charge it seven times. MacBook Pro or MacBook, 45 watts, almost two times. If you're looking at an iPad at 30 watts, you're gonna get 2.5 times. Drones, you know, definitely gonna be able to get, depending on the capacity, about two and a half times. Uh, a GoPro or a DSLR, 15 times. And the cool thing is that this is gonna support, as well as this guy right here, is gonna support various charging rates or charging uh, types, like PD 3.0, uh, Qualcomm Fast Charging 3, and also Qualcomm Fast, uh, Qualcomm Charging 4 Plus. So you're going to get those uh, high charging rates on Samsung devices and any other device that can support those fast charging rates. Now, we also then have this uh, GAN charger, which is really small, but then has a lot of ports, 100 watts. So these side-by-side -side go really well. So let's take a closer look, and we'll look at some cables that they sent us as well. Now we've been testing this out as we've been doing recordings and then also using them on a daily basis. A couple things that I'll highlight is with the Storm 2, you do get a USB-C cable, pretty robust, and um, it's, it's long, right? So you can have a real nice, healthy USB-C to USB-C cable. Now with this charger right here, they sent us a couple charging cable options, right? USB-C to USB-C, and then also one that will support your iPhone. So it has the iPhone proprietary connector. But the USB-C, don't worry, is also gonna work on an iPad. So this is gonna work on any device that will support, um, again, uh, USB-C um, or you know proprietary cables like what you see right here. And they're also pretty robust. Now, as we take a look at this uh, charger, this charger is pretty cool, right? So transparent design, they uh, call it cyberpunk kind of look. Um, I kind of really dig the fact that you can see all the electronics. And you can see uh, here this display here that as you press this button, and uh, it's gonna allow you to modify certain options when it comes to outputs. Now, you don't have to touch this if you don't want to play with it, right? Uh, literally, it's gonna charge at the fastest possible rate for the device that's connected. So it's smart, it's intelligent, it's gonna make sure that there isn't any damage to your device because it has you know, power interruption, you know, overheating protection, has all these different things that are gonna protect um, your devices and the battery itself from being damaged. Now, over here is where you see all of the connectivity options. So you can see the choices that we have. You know, you have your two USB-C, you also have your USB-A, and then you have your DC output. And this is what it really looks like, right? So again, pretty cool looking. I like the appearance. And then it has a, a great display here that's gonna give you a lot of different options that you can mess with or you don't have to if that's something that you don't care to do. Now, in addition to that, we have their charger. And their charger is also pretty neat. I like their charger. Uh, I like the fact that it has this folding uh, legs right here and then what I also then like is that how nice and large all the fonts here are when it tells you that this is your PD port um, and it says 140 watts and then over here you have C2 um, charging right so you have C1, C2 so these are your two uh, USB-C chargers and when we think about the total watts here and um, I think I misspoke here because I talked about 100 watts is actually 140 watts when we talk about this one right here it's going to distribute the power throughout all of these ports to give you the best charging rate. Now, what that also means that if you do plug in uh, two Samsung phones, one of them is gonna charge it super fast and then the other one is not. It's gonna drop down um, and that's just protecting the charger and also protecting the phone. So you have a lot of, again, our charging options here. So let's plug some things in and just see how it works. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is we're gonna plug in the fold 
and we're gonna look to see what kind of color actually comes up on screen. You notice how that color, that teal blue, is means that it's doing super fast charging, which is what we want. And now what we're gonna do is plug in uh, this guy right here, which is my S22 Ultra, and you'll notice that both of them are charging at the fastest possible rate. That is super, right? So super fast charging on both. And that's something that's rare. You really don't find many batteries out there that are going to charge at the fastest possible rate. Two type of devices, especially these, given the power that you're going to get from it. So uh, this, you, again, you can put a magnetic puck on this so that you can charge your iPhone. You can use this for your iPad. You can use this to charge your laptop. Anything that can take power, USB-C. Now the GAN charger also is going to give you some really nice power. So we're going to do the same thing. I'm going to basically plug into this first one here and we're going to see what kind of charging rate we get. And you notice that we saw super fast charging there. Now what I'm going to do is go to the next one, plug that one in and see what kind of charging we get. Now notice this is what I mentioned before. Uh, basically you saw super fast charging at one and then standard charging, well it's fast charging, not super fast charging, um, happening in the second. I've seen this um, very frequently as I test different chargers. So you're gonna get one that's gonna get at the fastest rate and then the other one is gonna go fast but not quite as fast as it's distributing the power across each port. As I continue to use more ports, it's gonna to continue to distribute the power because we have a total of 140 watts. So guys, that wraps up our review. See you in the next video.